No dogs. Oh my God. Oh, hold on one sec. Technical difficulty. Okay, we're back. I think we're back. I hope we're back. Good morning, everybody. Thank you for joining whoever is here. Uh, it's a beautiful day here in uh, Tokyo. Uh, if you are here, let me know that you are here. Um, J Vlog, Muhammad, John, Sayuri, Mark, Ram. Who else is here? Vin. Thank you all for joining a little early. Um, one of my weird promises that I'm actually going to go early. And I did. NFL boy, how are you? Ed OB, Carlitos, Diana, Maria, hello. Good morning. Moto Gnome, evil sister right here. Evil sister. There's your evil sister. Um, so Hiromi and I, uh, we are going to be walking around uh, a neighborhood, uh, taking our puppies out for a walk. I thought, you know what? Some of you uh, don't get out so much, so why not enjoy uh, the sights um, of Tokyo? We are making sure that we do social distancing. Hey, Crazy Ann, how you doing? Konaman. And uh, just showing you a bit of a, another neighborhood that, uh, say hi, um, Al says hi. He calls you Mrs. Evil. She says, hi, Mr. Evil. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, so hope you guys enjoy and I'll try and read comments as we go Hold on one sec Of course, we got our puppies That's Chibi She's really excited to actually be out walking around uh, Moko is right somewhere There's Moko Of course And yes, I'm a big guy carrying Oh, see already water time it is water time. Good morning, A1. We do have our masks on. We are being careful to uh, make sure that we do social distance. But, you know, right now, a lot of the grocery stores, albeit they do have... Uh, they do have uh, tape and stuff. A lot of people are still not uh, really social distancing. Oh, that's pretty cool. So hopefully you guys uh, enjoy our, our little walk. We needed to get out of the house. Uh, I was talking with Mohammed earlier for about an hour. So thanks, bro. I look forward to seeing what, uh, if anything, we can do as quickly as possible. Hey, Indigo. This is the back streets uh, in Bunkyoku. And you're going to see a lot of old kind of style things going on like this meg milk it's obviously closed but uh you know these if you don't explore the back alleys and things like that uh like i always say you'll never really truly experience japan even like just stores or buildings houses you know kind of like this these are typical 50 year old Japanese houses. Of course, I'm in the back. The people with the orange uh, shirts are from a kindergarten, taking the kids out for a walk, it looks like. Chibi is getting excited. Careful, babe. <laughs> so. This here is, looks like a uh, little kindergarten. And this little street here can get busy with a bunch of different things going on. <laughs> I don't know what Chibi is doing. Oh, that's cool. See, I would never have seen a store like this. No idea what, it, what kind of store it is or somebody's garage. <laughs> somebody's garage. That's pretty cool. Good morning, Anthony. Hey, Nick. I do have the sun in my eyes, so I can't really see uh, too much of uh, the comments here. Chibi is wild, isn't she? Is she ever something? <coughs> Chibi's just excited to get out. Moko doesn't really like to go for walks uh, ever since she was a baby. Um, 
but Chibi loves it. See, even a post office stuck right in the middle of nowhere, which I never knew, but my post office is a little bit closer. You got new buildings, you got old buildings all around here. And hopefully uh, we can take you to see some interesting things. I think there's some interesting things around here. Where is your morning beer? Um, maybe later. <laughs> maybe, maybe. You know, as we pass by, you'll see different side streets like this. Oh, here comes the delivery guy on a bike. This is how they deliver local packages, which is pretty cool. Could you imagine riding around on a bike all day? That's a pretty cool facade. The street is not typically busy. <laughs> Hiromi just pointed it out here. Buzz Lightyear. Somebody's got a Buzz Lightyear sitting on their front door. That's freaking hilarious. Ugh. All kinds of different things to, uh, to see. And actually the main road is just right there. So we're only a street behind, and uh, the street is kind of nice. To, it, we're walking up towards uh, Hakusan Dori or Hakusan Station. If anybody is wondering where we are on Google Maps, original bread. This looks like a bakery. What is that, Bib? Like a sandwich place or a bakery? Oh, damn. LMA. He pop up again. You're gonna be like Chibi when this lockdown is done? I bet. Thank you, Jackie, how are you? This yellow place up here, the sign, I think it's a, another daycare in the building itself. You can see the gated little area for the kids to play in. So I guess they'll make, uh, Kindergartens and hoikuns anywhere they can find space. <coughs> I think when it gets up further, as we're walking along, uh, there are some interesting uh, stores that we usually find. This is an actual, uh, what do you call it here, a little drugstore. Not very big. It looks like it's got a bunch of adult diapers, you know, things like Moto Gnome would use. Oh, I'm so quick today. Loving the, the doors, the outside. I always like these kind of things, as you know. You know, yeah, you can have uh, common, you know, looking buildings and stuff, but whenever I see old Japanese style things, I always get excited. And no, not bachans. <laughs> Even the Japan Post uh, trucks are kind of cute. And please, as you are here, oh, look at this, Judy's Neat. I have no, I thought that was meat. Nope, not selling meat in there. Candy Boutique. This restaurant here, the new Okachan, is more of your local. I've never seen, they do have takeout, but uh, you know, it's got your karages and all kinds of different things. <coughs> no idea where we're really going though. We ended up just walking. You know, if we were to walk straight, turn right and kind of zigzag a couple corners, we'd actually hit Nezu Shrine. There is an interesting place up here. I don't know if it's still here. Something about beer. That's all I remember. Is that beer place up here, babe? Oh, is this the place here? So this Cafe Guanda, or whatever it's called here, right in front here. They actually serve Belgian beers, but uh, they serve hot beer, which is really weird. 
Oh, is it? Yeah, it is a beautiful day here. I think it's uh, 22 degrees, you said, babe? So it is just an amazing day. You can still see people out and about. Drew, wow. Look at that door. What's up, sir? Hey, Tim the dude. Oh, that bicycle shop is gone, eh? Oh, I thought it was the bicycle shop. Huh. So yeah, that's it for the side street, then it comes out to the main road again. You wanna walk down that other street over there? Cross up or go straight? This is kind of where we decide which way are we gonna go. So Hakusan Station will be straight ahead of us there. Minus seven and snowing ram, really? Damn, dude. I just hope that, you know, wherever you guys are, you're keeping safe, keep warm. Obviously, I am. I got a freaking hoodie on and a down vest. I always overdress thinking it's cold, and it's not. Weird. Mm -hmm. Panda Moon. Hey, Jonathan. Oops. It's hard to walk moco at the same time hey mal <coughs> oh my goodness hey alan how are you happy bert i think it was you like you just turned 20 years old alan i think i saw something about that on facebook i think that's you ore no ikurimichi what is that babe ramen oh yeah down this street here, we're, we hit all these little local shops. Some are good. Thank God some are closed. Oh, massage. But they're, oh, they're open. Oh no, they're closed. Not sure what this place is, but. What's, what's this massage place? 60 minutes, 3460. And then you can see the menu, obviously, of different things. I don't know, massage in Japan after being in Thailand. Oh, thank you, sir. I appreciate it, Alan. Oh, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Alan. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, bro. How many massage places near me? Uh, not many. Um, not like it is in Thailand. Like when Hiromi and I were in Thailand a few years ago, like we could, you couldn't get us out of the massage parlors. Oh, what's this? Oh, just noodles. See, they're stocked fully, which is a good thing. A little Italian restaurant. So yeah, it's just, you know, walk, taking the tour, walking around uh, the back streets. Of course, you're going to hear me start huffing and puffing because, well, yeah, I need to walk too. I think Moko's walking me. I'm not walking Moko. And, oh, that's cool, eh, babe? Those stairs. See, this is these are kind of the views you find, guys. I don't know. For me... Just seeing these stairs and things like that, that's pretty cool because you just never know what you're gonna find. Am I out of shape? Uh, yeah. <laughs> hang, hang out with the TD crew more and you'll, uh, you'll get to know exactly what I'm like. I have lost 11 kilograms, but I've maintained that weight for about three weeks now. Gotta get losing more, but been eating too good, I guess you could say. Oh, is that the bike shop there? Oh, okay. Sorry, this is the bike shop up on the left here that I was talking about. And we're talking $2,000 to $5,000 bikes inside there. This is like, you know, quite a, an amazing looking bike shop. 
Like, seriously. Now we're coming out of the side street onto the main street. Uh, and typically these are all universities. So Bunkyoku is uh, well known for uh, jump, jump. There you go. Bunkyoku is typically known to, uh, you know, be famous for uh, universities in and around Tokyo area. So what's this first university here, babe? Sorry? This is a high school, junior high Oh, is it, oh, is it really? Oh, sorry. So this is a junior, this is actually a junior high school in a high school. I guess the university up is, is up past there. <coughs> Look at that, that's crazy, eh? I always like, you know, from being back in Canada, you got your, up. Oh, you got your high schools, you know, you got a big area. You don't expect to, uh, hey Fang, you don't expect to see just a building and it being like a high school or junior high school. I don't know, for me, you should see a football field and a soccer field and a big building as a school. But, looks pretty cool. Obviously, uh, into the administration. Yes, uh, so here in Japan, it's kind of like, I don't know, back in public school when I went to high school and stuff, you know, you wear what you want, but you, in Catholic school, you had to wear a uniform. But here in Japan, uh, in high school, they have uniforms. They're bloody expensive. You could be talking anywhere from 500 to $1,000 just for uniforms, uh, baby. All right, we got to stop for a sec. It's poop time. Hold on. No. I can't turn the camera around. All right, okay. Chibi went poop. Got to clean it up. Clean her butt. the ground. Could be right here. Pet. I got the water bottle. Yeah, I got the water bottle here. Ugh. Disaster averted. It was poop. Time. Oh man, I gotta go poop now. <laughs> oh, thank you, Alan, for uh, sending me the message. Okay, Hiromi, I think is is wondering, does this building here look like it's tilting? The leaning building of Tokyo. <laughs> Vin. I know, she says it's, uh, it's tilting. Really? They agree with you. All right, who's, who, who, who? Oh, garbage day. Oh, huh. some little cute tea it's called. <laughs> That's weird. Closed. Oh, they're still building it. Maybe you know me as high. <laughs> Moto Gnome's like, of course we agree. We're fearful of her. <laughs> Al, I think it's just you. 
You know my wife well. Is that Robert in the house? I think the land is not level. I, I, I bet you I agree with you better. So this here is a university area. It's Toyo University. Wow, I can read. Of course, they do have a guard station. Hey, Cobra. <coughs> wow, people. Look, it's a Lawson. <laughs> so yeah, we're just walking kind of up the main street here. I have a feeling uh, we actually get puppies. Uh, <laughs> there's a, our, our dog trimmer is up this way. Drew, is it true you're going to tour the Dyson? Mm, ignore the comment, oh, baby. Chibi's got to go to the washroom again. So you can see that the streets are dead. Typically, this street isn't that uh, great anyways. Hey, Maria. Um, and please smash that like button, people. Let's get 50 likes today before we finish. Then again, you know, if Luis was here, he'd be uh, saying smash that like button. That, that's my way of calling Luis out if he's lurking. Where is the hashtag, man? Your wife can be the spokesperson for Dyson. <laughs> They're doing the Dyson talk again, babe. <laughs> she just chuckled. But yeah, not much uh, going on, it looks like. Um, it is nice. Uh, thank you, Leon. It is nice. Uh, follow the sun, 399. Huh? It is uh, nice to be able to get out and walk. Yesterday, I uh, on my way home, Obviously, I stopped off in uh, Akihabara and walked home, so hopefully you guys enjoyed that. You know, to see if people are social distancing. As we get up further up here, we're almost going towards uh, Sugamo Station. Dyson Fine 399. Ah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, it might get a bit busier, but, uh, you know, typically we're trying to walk in areas... Oh, it's hard to talk with a mask. Uh-oh. Whoa. You don't, my wife can run. I didn't know that. <laughs> and Hiromi's got a cool mask on, the black. It's kind of stretchy, which is pretty cool. I'm wearing the old uh, disposable ones. Just because they're a little bit sm the one she's wearing is a little bit smaller for my face. Don't say I got a big head because I know I do. Only 32 likes. God, you guys don't like me today, huh? <laughs> oh, I remember we went up that way one time. Beautiful trees up there. Yeah, let's go up there. Let's go check it out instead of get, get off the main road here. Yeah, we're going to hit some more back streets. Uh, I just saw some like really nice scenery here. <coughs> By the way, did anybody receive their postcards and packages recently? I know uh, the U.S. Postal Service is... Hey, Stephanie. Um, really uh, slow. I'm going to try and uh, in the next couple of days. Usually I send postcards out on the 20th. Never makes it on time, but I think I'm gonna try and send them out uh, earlier. Hold on. For no reason, the medical field, how come she lets you keep wearing the mask backwards? <laughs> Bite me, Jay Vlog. <laughs> Uh, 
Well, shouldn't I be wearing two masks? One to cover my eyes and the other one to cover my... Anyways, no, I just saw this like little tree area here. It's always beautiful, you know, no matter where you are in Japan, how, you know, well they take care. The blue nets are for the garbage, even, you know, like, like on garbage days, everything is clean. It truly does amaze me. Like these are some nice flowers. I don't know what that is, but it looks pretty nice. Of course, A1 really likes it when I zoom in or get close to the flowers, so that's what we'll do. Those look nice. It just creates a really nice atmosphere, eh? Especially, you know, everybody's locked, no, well, not locked down, but. <clears throat> so, blue sides are for medical masks. Um, I'm not using a medical mask. You have flurries there today in Ontario? Damn. I know a few of you all live in the Toronto area. I think Stephanie, Emma lives there, Moto Gnome, uh, Swastik. Maybe a couple other people. Yes, we are walking dogs. Uh, here, I'll point the camera down a bit here. This is Moko here. And of course you can see Hiromi's feet. Chibi's up there somewhere. Yes, I have a pink leash on my puppy. And I'm not afraid to admit it. Big boy like me with pink leashes and white puppies. Hmm. But they are awesome. Where are you going, Moko? Moko always has her way. She doesn't like to uh, step over top of uh, anything metal. Representing Markham. Sending their darn snow down to Illinois. Where's Tar Tar oh, Tarana? <laughs> All right, which way do you want to go now, babe? Left? Across the street? Whatever you think, yeah. We kind of hit... Uh, when is garbage pickup? No idea. Uh, we do have... Some, uh, Moto Gnome is asking about the nice red and white leashes that were given to us last year. Water? Water time. We do... And we have little sockies too. One of our subscribers uh, gave them to us last year in the summertime. And uh, they're amazing leashes. They are pretty awesome, yeah. But today we just grabbed the pink ones. Thanks, Mohammed. Hopefully when I get home, uh, you'll have some idea of the project that we're working on. Thank you so much. Because I'm going to be making an announcement pretty soon. So hopefully we can get something done. Um, but I appreciate the help, brother. And let me know, message me about the Photoshop uh, thing you were telling me about. What's the speed limit on city streets there? Ontario residentially streets are 40 or 50 kilometers. There are 30 kilometers here. If we find a sign, maybe we can show you, but... We're gonna hang out to the left here. <coughs> so we're almost over at Hakusan area. These are actual bike lanes, I believe. The blue. And I wish that they had this throughout Tokyo. Um, you know, because a lot of people do bike. This is like an old grandma grandpa interior shop probably don't do much business a pr is coming just for feng <laughs> a 
There's all kinds of little things around. <laughs> New Life Laundry. Over there is uh, the Eon My Basket. It's kind of like a little grocery store, convenient, pumped up convenience store. Very uh, helpful. They are in all the local neighborhoods. Hola! What are they making here, babe? I just see alcohol, 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 and beef. Yum. <laughs> alcohol and beef. Do you need much more? Damn. So yeah, hopefully you guys are enjoying this little walk that we're having. Not sure what side streets we're gonna go down. Sometimes like you know me. Oh, that's funny as hell. Check that out. I wonder if it's a pork place. So what is this for? Ramen or Just a little izakaya style. It's a small door. Damn. Robert K in the house. <laughs> it's funny because of the lag on the stream. I show you guys something and then I watch your comments come in. It's hilarious. Happy Wednesday, Drew Edo B. Uh, happy Wednesday, yeah. Not at work. I will be off work for a long time. So you guys are going to be getting a lot of uh, live streams coming up. Hey, Black Tango. Mmm, bacon. Um, Got to be trying, trying to be creative as I can, but uh, still a bit difficult. God, the look on that guy in the hoodie behind me right now was hilarious. <laughs> so we are actually walking up towards Sugamo. So I'm, I'm thinking, do we keep walking, babe? Go to, uh, whatchamacallit street? Is that too far? Should be okay? All right, well, we decided to show you something special in about 10 or 15 minutes from now. Um, <coughs> Freshest Burger, cross the street. So we are now uh, Sengoku Station. Uh, for those of you that uh, actually follow me on Google, which I know a couple of you do. This here, this kitchen origin here, I know JVlog probably has it in, down where he is, Nagasaki. Um, they make amazing uh, bento boxes and uh, things to order. What's your wife think of upcoming Bubbles with Drew live stream? You know what they want me to do? They want me to take a bubble bath and do a live stream. <laughs> she just laughed. <laughs> She's like, uh, yeah, okay, go ahead. Just make sure I'm not around. She didn't say that. I'm just saying that for her. <coughs> uh, yeah, bubble baths, kind of scary. It's getting to, hold on, babe. Sorry. To be 16 tonight in St. Paul, Minnesota. Oh, good. Hi, Lynn. How are you? Josh Skinner, you work for a company planning to make rain popcorn in Tokyo. Hey, I'm trying to get the finger. You are Kona Mon, but it's not working. Gotta try harder, man. When we walk down the street, you know, it might sound crazy, but we always stay to the left-hand side. Does anybody have a reason? Can you guess why? And no, you don't have to walk on the left or the right or anything like that. Oh, is Luis here? Can you, hey, babe, can you turn around and say hi to Luis and B? <laughs> so we actually, you know, obviously it, it, it might sound stupid, but it took me a long time to figure it out. And that was we walk um, on the left side of the road so that the puppies have, you know, an edge. Um, and we've trained them to walk on the left side of us. Well, Chibi. Moko does really well. Chibi, I don't know about. This way they got these bushes and, you know, just little things like that. Oh, see, Chibi. She's thirsty. There goes Moko. 
It's water time. And what's really cool is I like the look of this place too, right outside here. That's pretty cool. Hey, Louise, how are you? Uh, I hope you get your microphone working for uh, Sunday morning Patreon TD crew chat. Gotta have you talking, man. Just saying. Will they walk on the same side they drive on? I have no idea what the hell you're talking about. So obviously, I'm not sure exactly what Konaman's talking about, but you know, we do drive like the British or the, I believe Australians do. Everybody else obviously drives on the right side of the car, on the right side of the road, yada, yada, yada. You lucky to work? Ooh, the Hana Club. Most of the USA is shut down. Yeah, that's what I've heard. That's a small little thing. <laughs> what the hell are they gonna do with that? If we just keep walking, we're getting further and further away from home. That is an actual uh, Denny's over there and a drugstore. Um, the drugstore is quite famous. There, are, there, It is a chain around. And then you actually have another little uh, medical thing over there. We're actually going straight and we're going to be showing you uh, something that's uh, quite famous. And um, But it's kind of like uh, ta Takeshitori in Harajuku but for old people. Uh, some of you might have seen uh, a live stream or, or video that I've done on this before, but we're gonna take you over there and you know, basically see our people social distancing, how's the stores doing over there. And actually, they got some pretty awesome food. Mizuho Bank is open. I'm getting hot and sweaty. But I got my down jacket on, duh. And then, and then they get cars like this that just block the intersection because they're idiots. You okay, Mo? Don't worry, Drew, I missed the comment. Are you guys talking about bubble baths still? Chinese restaurant? It says Chinese restaurant. Oh, I could use some Chinese food. Mmm, I'm hungry. I could easily drive in Japan. Absolutely, follow the sun. Drew, get your wife to give you some water. Do I have to get down on the ground too? <laughs> <coughs> so it does open up here. Uh, we are almost at Sugamo Station, right, babe? Sugamo? Hashtag convinced you to do a bubble bath. Really? Really? You saw? Oh, yeah, there was. I, did, I didn't even notice the actual phone booth back there. Lap it up. <laughs> Ooh, curry sandwiches, cake, charcoal roasted coffee, and they're closed. Oh, man. Pretty sad though, all the convenience stores. Like yeah, of course the convenience stores are open, that's great. But man, I wish some of the Ma and Pa places, oh that's a nice looking view. Damn. I wish some of the Ma and Pa places were open. Uh, A1 asks, what's with everyone wanting to see you in a bubble bath? I don't know, ask everybody else. Uh, a1, because I have no idea. It's kind of scary. Curry and cheesecake, babe. Oh, that's weird. Curry and cheesecake. I like the Route 66 sign, but... 
even though it's been open since 1966. Half, hashtag bubble bath live streams. Oh my God, you guys, like really guys? You, you guys are just weird. I don't expect anything less from you guys, but still, you're weird. Ah. Okay, I gotta start unzipping layers of clothing here. Oh. So hopefully you guys will enjoy the uh, uh, second part of uh, the live stream. I'm gonna keep going as long as I can. You love us? Yeah, I do. Of course, you guys are all a part of the community, right? Well, it's a small working garage, but hell, good enough, mm, you know. Um, so yeah, we're, we're about five minutes away from Tsugamo uh, station area. Uh, it's a very nice uh, area. And um, stick size, I have no idea. Show you Tong to restaurants are closed so I'm really hoping that maybe we can grab something to take home for lunch <coughs> you know some uh, karaoke or you know just some nice stuff that's uh, about the dice and it always sucks but never gets spits <laughs> uh, you guys have freedom today with your Dyson and your Nato and your roller coasters Now you can see like we're probably a good half an hour walk 40 minute walk or whatever hi drew my wife was from sugomo and she's really excited to know how the situation is there oh cool i'm glad that you're along here i'll you will turn the camera around There's a little uh, mom and baby. She's like, oh, puppy. Really, Jackie? Like, of course you're gonna f join the ranks of Luis ah, and Vin. I'm, I'm, I should be okay right now. If I get any hotter, then I'm screwed. Really, Jackie? Right, Nick? Don't scare the child. <laughs> All right, so uh, Sugamo is basically two stoplights ahead of us. Uh, it is a very interesting area. Um, what's famous about Sugamo? Do you know? Hmm? Oh, the temple? Really? Oh, my God. You guys are nuts, man. Really, you cobra? What is with this light being so long? All right, here we go. So you can see now, you know, people, are they social distancing? Um, of course, you know, if you're with a family of people, then, you know, the whole family should be uh, staying apart from each other. But time will tell. As soon as we get up here where it gets a bit busier um, as to, you know, are they listening? Are they doing it? Ooh, that's an Incon Hunko shop. Mossburger. Never liked Mossburger, man. You like Mossburger, eh, babe? Yeah. She likes the size of the burgers. I don't know. For me, I think if you're going to eat a burger, you might as well eat a big burger. But I don't know. The traditional Mossburger comes with like a thick tomato and some sauce, and the patty is just not. Like, if you're going to eat a burger, at least have like a double quarter pounder size. You know? That's just me. Mm, I can smell the curry from Coco Curry. Love this place. I've done every level you can imagine in this place from one all the way up to ten. Coco Curry's is an institute, people. If you come to Japan and you do not experience Japanese curry from Coco Curry, 
Don't come back. So I can see up there, it's getting a bit busier. And people just don't seem to social distance. For 50 likes, what, Drew will do what? No. <laughs> I don't like how you guys control how many likes I'm gonna do for what though. Hashtag Coco Curry Bubble Bath. <laughs> See, they have all the bread wrapped individually, which is a good thing. That's a little mermaid. And now it's gonna start getting busier. <coughs> and this is basically where, you know, Hiromi and I will not walk near anybody, keep at least a two meter distance. Um, but it can be hard when people ignore the fact and, you know, so honestly, some of them, you know, think, oh, I'm wearing a mask, so it's okay. But no, of course, it's not. Now, if I actually, hey, Nancy, how are you? I think that would... Seriously, Nick, what's with you? Huh? Beck's coffee! Oh, Beck's coffee! <laughs> like I said in a couple live streams, because Hiromi was walking, you didn't see it, she was off camera. She turns around to me with her eyes wide open like, oh my God! And then I look up and she yelled out, of course, as you heard, Beck's coffee! Don't ask what it's about, it's funny to us. We're just a weird married couple. Thank you very much. I think we should cross the street, eh? <coughs> so this here is Sugamo Station. Again, not very busy, which is a good thing. It might be a bit busier. Ooh, scary. We're gonna cross here. <coughs> Excuse me. They have a very beautiful uh, river area here but we're actually going to be walking down here and then they have like a, a nice little temple area and they actually have a shopping street which is what I want to show you guys for those of you that are here and hopefully you know for, honestly for those of you that are stuck inside and haven't been out in days hopefully this little walk will uh, give you some sort of enjoyment or peace of mind or something Oh, it's not. I thought it was a river. It's train tracks. Duh. Okay, never mind. So that is uh, Sugamo Station, like I had said over there. So whoever's wife is from Sugamo area, um, you know, not that, not that many people, but at the same time enough. And honestly, right now what we're experiencing is not enough people are like staying away from each other they're just walking and taking up their own space but this undercover area here it's a nice little area um, with a bunch of decent shops so hopefully you enjoy it oh my god look at that oh yum yum but it's closed eh till May 6th vegetable shop is open which is good. And here, you guys can see now, people are just, I don't know what it is, but we're trying to stay away from this lady and her kids, and they just walk wherever. Social distance. And they just ignore it. Look at, look at the crowd up ahead here. You know, at first when this whole thing started going on, I was like, ah, social distance, nobody's doing it. Now I'm so worried about it. Um, but living in Tokyo is very hard. You know, people just don't seem to, you know, Hiromi's trying to be careful. Um, but 
you know, of the people that should be social distancing, we're in like a typically well-known elderly area now. You'll see, you know, basically all old people. They're not social distancing. They just walk. But you know, there are a bunch of uh, nice little places. Oh, what's this? Mochi. Some rice. They should be careful, right? Okay, wait a sec here. Uh, hold on, babe. Let me uh, just step off to the side here. Come on, people. Stop. Don't make me have Drew remove wrenches. You're not here to troll. Uh, what's going on? Are moderators trolling me? Is that what's going on? Because I'm, I haven't been reading all the comments. You have a wrench because. So um, be good. So we are coming up here now. Um, Oh, the Dyson Spam? Yeah, cut it out, guys. Really, Nancy? Here comes this lady and her kids again, just running wherever. Yeah, you do talk about random stuff. I can't handle spice very well, even though I have eaten a level 10 cocoa curry. Uh, it's not that expensive to live in. <laughs> it's got a McDonald's, doesn't it? <laughs> With a delivery uh, thing. <coughs> See, people just walk. They don't think about where they're going. And uh, I'm just I, it, this this social distancing is going to get to me after a while. So like we're stepping, you know, at least a couple meters away, but. Anyways, I, I don't like spice. Uh, I have eaten uh, anywhere from level 1 to 10 in, in curry. But usually uh, when I do eat spice, even when Hiromi and I were in Thailand, we are having pad thai, and I found it a little spicy. So I guess it depends on my mood, right? Pad thai is not spicy. <laughs> Hiromi's like, pad thai is not spicy. Well, there was something that we had that was spice. So yeah, I'm not typically good with spice. As you guys have seen, I've tried making noodles when we're at the studio in my area now. I have the right to turn away customers who do not wear masks in their establishments. So. Just trying to tire out the kids so she can have some peace later. Probably. Closed McDonald's, that's why non-spicy Thai Korean food. She's having a hard time. Wear masks for the first time today. Shopping, really mambo. Mabu dofu, I would love it. I would love Mabado food. So this here, um, well, we have a little side temple area here. It's beautiful. We're not going to go in. At least I don't think so. Just trying to keep our distance, which is still pretty hard now. Um, so now this is, uh, what is this called again? Sug I forget the name. I'll, I'll show you guys the name in a sec here. Shinshoji Temple is down uh, this way. And this is kind of like local shopping. Um, it's quite, got lots of snacks and all kinds of pretty amazing things. Now this is typically the Harajuku, uh, the Takeshitadori, I guess you could say, for old people. You know, for people like Moto Gnome, Robert Kosinski, you know, LMA. It's the only shot I can get at you guys. You will see a lot of red, I believe, which, oh, look at this, this is like a pickles shop. I live on the outskirts of London. I go out biking exercise, not Tour de France style. Oh, cool. Um, 
Thank you for posting the Patreon link. I, oh, you're still here, Motonome? Oh, I'm sorry. Why not ban running in these times? That's a good, probably a good idea. But you can see like a lot of uh, old uh, kind of people style stores. Clip joint, I have no idea what that is, but the mural on the side, oh, I guess it's like a hair salon. Yeah, clip joint, okay, I get it now. This lady's really pissing me off, babe, <laughs> with her two kids. <laughs> so you'll see a lot of red. I, now the red signifies something. I'm not gonna say on a live stream. Somebody can comment on it, I, I guess. Hey Drew, my wife says you should check out Tokiwa Shokudo when you go. Do you know that, babe? Down this road, babe. Tokiwa Shokudo. Do you know? No? Well, if we see it, we will. But again, look at all these you know quaint little shops here. It's got a bunch of sembe. Um, I swear to God, babe, hold on. Like, I don't know what she's doing. Like, she's stupid, hey? Here, oh, give me the water, babe. Sorry, I didn't realize I was... Oh, okay. Sorry, guys, we're just having this uh, conversation about these, this lady. I don't know what the hell she's doing with her kids. But we got to keep stopping. Well, if we walk on the other side of the street, then the puppies are closer to the road, and we don't want that. I'm almost getting ready to, like, I don't know what the hell she's doing. I'm going to go for a smoke. <sighs> I need a back alley for a minute. Oh, there's a ledge and a back alley, but I don't want my wife to work. Wait. Uh, we'll keep walking down. We tried walking like faster than them and then they caught up to us and I don't know what she's doing, but it's a very quaint little place. Uh, what's that sweet potato called? Remember we got one time here? What was it called? Dai Dai Gaku Imo. There's a really cool great shop here. <laughs> Which if we see it, I'll show you guys. Um I was never a sweet potato fan until I actually came here. I don't like sembe. Oh, thank God they're leaving. Now there is a shop. Is this the shop here? Baba and Gigi love Moko and Chibi? One of these shops. But not many people out, which is good, except for that lady and her kids. Dagaku Imo, yes. Oh, Chibi. Surprised, eh, babe? And then up here is the temple on the uh, right-hand side. But this is, uh, yeah, your Takeshita Dori, Takeshita Street in Harajuku for old people. Oh, Alame, Moto Gnome, Wanamaker, or who is that? <laughs> That's the only three guys I can pick on that pick on me. And like all these businesses are going along here. Hey, Chibi Chan. So, would you typically come shopping here? Not unless you really want something, you know, very authentic, I guess. I would never go shoe shopping here, of course. What's that say? What's up, Drew? How you guys making out? Uh, hey, Tiger in America. It's been a long time since I've seen you. Actually, first time I've ever seen you is probably your husband, isn't it, talking, actually? This is the uh, temple. We're going to go check that out later. How are you, James? Because I know it's you, not uh, your wife. <laughs> I was watching you guys eat crab the other day. I think it was a Facebook post or something or Instagram or... There's a lot of freaking crab, man. 
Oh, Jason here. How are you? So yeah, this uh, basically, you know, on, on a weekend, you know, due to the situation, uh, this, you know, if it was just a normal month here in Japan, this place would be packed, like seriously packed. And uh, PR, it's, it, it's an experience because it goes down about another kilometer or so. Um, you know, you got all these quaint shops selling, you know, sembeis to sweet potatoes to all kinds of different things. And that's what I love about this place. There it is. That's the sweet potato. Uh, maybe on our way back. I'm sorry? Oh, yeah. I gotta go pee. <laughs> Uh, we'll, we'll walk down just a little bit more. Now this street is still open to traffic too. So it is a bit difficult to walk around. Let's just go up here for a minute, babe. That's good enough. Just want to go up here and set the gimbal down for a minute. Oh, oh, I just need a, I need a quick break for a second here. Oh, I found a ledge for a sec, so oh, let, the, let our babies have a bit of water, maybe have a quick smoke. Just a couple puffs. But yeah, you know, it's nice to be able to get out and uh, walk around. Um, so, you know, some people are, you know, like, why are you out walking? And well, because we're not the same situation as where, you know, some people may be, right? So. I think I'm making octopus and pasta bake while I'm watching. Awesome, Black Tender. No peeing is going to happen in this alley. Oh, okay. I'll get, thank you, Jason. I'll get Hiromi to say thank you. Once she uh, comes in, I'll show her, of course. How do you got though, Nat? Oops, I almost timed you out. <laughs> Did it again. <laughs> uh, you okay, Mo? Uh. <coughs> Thank you, Jason. Um, we will definitely get something here. Bib? Jason's uh, donated uh, $9.99. <laughs> says treat you and he, and treat for you and Hiromi. I just wanted to come over and say thank you. That's all. When you can, <laughs> she's off camera. She's like, thank you. <laughs> What's that? Moko's getting tired. Jason's a TD crew member, so Hiromi says thank you. Arigatou gozaimashita. Um, yeah, no puppy wagon today. We do have a backpack. But, you know, Moko's a bit fat, so I, I, I really hope that she'll keep walking. Um, thanks, Veg. I think that's a, Truly appreciate it. Yeah, let's get out of here. I'm just putting my, I'm just putting my cigarette out, guys. I just wanted a couple of pops. Oh, and Tim says hi. <laughs> I just put my cigarette out. <coughs> All right, you wanna go back and get the sweet potato? Okay, we're gonna get uh, dye. So maybe you can explain those. Sorry, we've got a bit of a thing going on here. So we're just gonna walk back. I wanna see Jay Vlog's comment, another TD crew member. Maybe you can explain those 10 110 signs behind you while resting. Damn, I missed it. Sorry, dude. We, uh, it's kind of hard to, Hiromi wants to go over and get the thing, so that's what I'm doing. Yeah, I will show you guys uh, the store here. And uh, <clears throat> it's right here, actually. Check this out. We're gonna get uh, some of this here. There's two different kinds here. 
I don't know which one she wants. Which one do you want to get? I don't know which one you want. Oh, I don't care. I don't. You know which one I like, so. No idea. But this is what we're uh, looking at here, guys. That one? Yeah. Okay. Get whatever you want. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, do you have money? <laughs> so it's uh, 500 grams. Uh, it's about 1,400 yen. So it is a little expensive, guys, but uh, it seriously is delicious. Oh, Chibi sees some more puppies. Here's some money. Hi, baby. Chibi. Sorry, guys. We got another puppy walking by and trying to figure out. We got the leashes all done up. Sorry. Shopping with puppies is kind of hard. They also have, what's that there? Sweet potato pie? Oh, that there is sweet potato pie. That looks pretty awesome. Damn. So it is, a, it is like a, um, you know, a little store. Um, and they're just serving like sweet potatoes, which is pretty cool. You can see here, you know, the, uh, so the, Sorry, it's 1,500 or 1,700 yen. Um, you know, about seven to nine, 15 pieces, you know, whatever you want. Um, but thank you guys, uh, Jason and Feng. I truly appreciate it. And uh, I'll have like one piece and Hiromi will finish the rest for her snack. Oh yeah, this is a... Oh yeah. And here guys, they are social distancing. They do have plastic up between the customer and um, the uh, cashiers. So a lot of stores are doing this now. Thank God. But there are still stores that are not doing it. Like a lot of stores that are not doing it. You know, they're trying to sell their bento boxes. Um, why not get a couple what? we actually don't like the sweet potato pie that much we we know a store that like that place has the uh the daifuku whatever you call it uh which is good but the sweet potato pie uh we know a store that actually has better well in our opinion anyways because we come here a lot into this area at least once or twice a month okay i guess that's not that a lot but you know there are so many areas to visit in uh, the tokyo area Went shopping for a few things. Sweet potato pie, Feng. <laughs> we really need to get Feng. Uh, this here is the temple area, of course. Uh, interesting temple. Um, there is a reason for this temple. I just forgot what it was. <laughs> of course I did. But again, like I just love the look of these beautiful uh, things here. Like, just the craftsmanship is beautiful to me, anyways. It's a very small temple, actually. Um, you have the main temple part. And then you have this over here, and they actually have a lineup here uh, where you pour water over the head of that. What, what would you call that? Not even sure. We're not really into all these temple culture things, but. Oh, good, good to hear, Robert. But yeah, this, and then you can see that this um, wooden thing or whatever it is with all the wire. They actually have the lanterns up at night, but they've taken those down now for festivals and things like that. So it's still a pretty nice little area. Um, you know, come walk around for an hour experience other parts of Tokyo but um, you know typically on a normal month this, this place will be packed during the day on uh, weekends it's even worse uh, if you can put up with old people because I guess you know all, obviously all the shops cater to the older people 
But this is honestly where you can find a lot of uh, specialty shops. Um, that's why we come here. You know, we come here for the sweet potato. Or we come here for, uh, well, this menchikatsu. Just kind of like when I was in Koenji, uh, looking for that menchikatsu that day. So there are different uh, things here. You know, they got yakitori I just passed by. Is that eel? Ooh. Oh, Moko's happy. <laughs> Some PR is petting my puppy. Okay, that didn't sound good. <laughs> is the sushi shop open? Looks like it, but nobody's inside. So yeah, that's uh, pretty much the whole uh, area, guys. Um, this is like a dango shop, manju, all kinds of, you know, Japanese sweets and stuff, which is pretty cool. Puerto Ricans in Tokyo, huh? I didn't uh, understand that. But we'll uh, walk up to the end here and say goodbye. Uh, I do want to say thank you to everybody for uh, joining and hanging out. We might go live later on. Um, hey, Sandra, how are you? So glad that you could make it. I'm happy. Ooh, deep fried garlic. Are you kidding me? Oh, I'm glad that she appreciated Enzo. Or I can't really read your name. Somebody in Hawaii. Right? And actually, I just bought like 20 cloves of garlic last night. This place, this place is tofu, and oh. they make like, a, tastes like a cheese from tofu. And oh, yeah? Tofu things, so. Oh. I hope you guys heard that. I hope you did. Uh, I told you garlic shop is awesome. Yes. I love garlic. I went and bought like, uh, I went and bought uh, 20 garlic, 20 cloves of garlic. Is this, oh, this is a garlic shop right here. Oh my God. Oh my freaking God. Like black garlic. 2,500 yen just for that bag of garlic there. 2,200 for the black. Garlic buns. Oh, that must be weird. The whole, a shop dedicated to garlic. How awesome is that? You want to try a garlic bun? It's, um, it's sold out. Oh, it's sold out? Oh, okay, never mind. It's sold out. Oh, yeah. You're always got to work tomorrow. So we had garlic last night. We actually made uh, garlic beef and onion nachos. Uh, whenever she has a day off, I always cook something garlic for her. Panic are still among the grocery stores. <laughs> actually, here... Uh, there is no panic. Um, there's uh, grocery stores that are completely full. It's uh, not as bad as, I, I guess, the situation there. You can get toilet paper now. You can get Kleenex and uh, all kinds of different stuff. So it is, uh, it's not as bad as it was like a month ago because they basically said in the Japanese news, don't panic. Everything will be stocked up every day. You'll be good. What's this selling? Oh yeah, that's the uh, mochi. Rice. Looks good. I was kind of hoping we could find like a menchikatsu kind of store. But... Uh, yeah, let me uh, walk into uh, the side here and uh, say goodbye. We'll just walk down the side street here, babe. Huh, Uber Eats. Uber Eats. Yes, we can get masks. Uh, masks are a little bit difficult. Good luck trying to find them. Um, hand sanitizer, yeah, we can get lots of. 
nothing available in the Toronto area. Eh? So that is uh, obviously the shrine area there. Garlic and potato soup sounds good. Damn, that does sound good. I should make some. Hiromi and I will be doing a cooking video uh, later on for food sessions. You too, Cobrat. Uh, thank you. Just gonna walk down and show you a bit of the side of the uh, the temple here and say goodbye. Vicky says hi and goodbye. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, I just wanted to get into the shade and uh, say goodbye. Uh, so she couldn't walk around there. So uh, again, guys, thank you so much. Uh, I'll just hear me say goodbye. Um, we do have a good hour to walk back home now. Uh, Jason and Feng uh, and Alan, thank you so much. Um, and yeah, Chibi, it's, it's the Chibster. Don't forget to hit the like button, please. It does truly help. Um, and uh, yeah, we're gonna be doing some cooking um, in the next few days. Um, I might do a live stream tomorrow or later today. No idea. I got a bunch of time off, so I got to uh, stay home and do a bubble bath live stream. Really, Luis? Really? <laughs> they really want me to do a bubble bath live stream. Oh, guys, take care. Thank you. And uh, we'll see you real soon. Keep it real, keep it raw, stay true to yourself. Because we do. Bye.